Hello, I'm Thomas McGowan. I want to thank you for joining us today as we take a brief look at the beautiful village of Sharon, Connecticut, located in Northwest Litchfield County. There's so much to see and do in Sharon, Connecticut. We won't have time to show it all to you today, so you'll have to come up and take a look for yourself. There are beautiful areas everywhere you look. Stone pillars, gates, beautiful grounds on the town green, long range vistas that will take your breath away, and beautiful lakes. The Sharon Audubon Center offers a very special place for you to go and commune with nature. Everywhere you turn, you'll see a different form of life, from flowers and bees, to deer, butterfly, and a feeling that only nature can provide. There's also skiing, kayaking, and fishing close by. These churches are outstanding and offer you a glimpse at historic brickwork. The Hotchkiss Library is most unique in the northwest corner of Litchfield County. With its beautiful rooms, original period woodwork and detail, stained glass windows, and a wonderful collection of books. Ellsworth Hill offers a variety of things to see and do, from hay rides, pick your own apples, pumpkins in the fall. It's a wonderful way to spend a day and the scenery is breathtaking, not to mention beautiful horses. And the Tri-Arts offers dramatic presentations, musicals, and comedies. If you're hungry, try When Pigs Fly. It's delicious southern barbecue at its very best. And you can't go wrong visiting the Stack Kitchen. And when you're ready for a rest, try the Sharon Country Inn. It's wonderful and right in the village. If you want to go shopping, there's a marketplace with several different shops. This is one of my favorite places in Sharon, Mudge Pond. You can come here and swim or play in summer to your heart's content. Sharon also offers a very good fire department and a hospital. Few villages in the northwest corner have these amenities. There are also flower shops, bookshops, a variety of historic buildings that have been transformed for practical use in today's modern world. You can't go wrong looking on the Sharon Green and seeing the historical houses mixed with these shops. And the past is not to be forgotten. There are so many more things to see and do in Sharon, you really need to come and see them for yourself. I want to thank you for joining us today. If you'd like more information on the village of Sharon, Connecticut, or you'd like to tour the village, feel free to contact me through the following information on your screen. I'm Thomas McGowan.